Hey everyone, my name is Melanie. I teach the Business Chakra System and I'm here to share with you all about intuitive business. So it's pretty exciting that we've even got this online platform right now to talk about intuitive intelligence. But even more so than that, I'm excited about how the business world is actually changing. So before we dive into the intuitive business modern world, I want to take you back a little bit in history. So let's go way, way back, like thousands and thousands of years, when the ancestors of our land really used their own intuition throughout their life. So they were connected to the earth, they were connected to the stars above and the skies above and they use the information and wisdom around energy to really navigate themselves through life. During this time, the world really operated with feminine energy. Feminine energy being how we connect to ourselves intuitively and really listening to that and trusting that. As our lifestyle began to change, there was new technology and new developments happening all around the world. And one of those things was actually the growth of our population. Now I want you to step forward or jump forward to the 18th century when the Industrial Revolution began. And I feel like this is a real pivoting point for our evolution as humans on this earth. It was at this time that the population was so big that we actually needed some really strong structures and foundations to start happening in the world for us to be able to sustain ourselves. And for one of those things was actually when the Industrial Revolution invented the schooling system. Now the schooling system, we really pride ourselves on that and that's how we learn so much. But in actual fact, when it was first invented, it was to create a system to develop factory workers. And through these factory workers, this is how we started to be begin to develop technologies and systems where we could grow on a larger scale. It has definitely been of benefit to our evolution, absolutely. But what happened is we went to the other extreme. So we went more into the masculine way of living on this planet, where it is all about structure and taking action and logistics and really thinking with the mind rather than uh, listening to our hearts and our intuition. For some people, they may feel like this industrial revolution and the evolution of man in this more masculine energy has been a little bit to our demise, but I actually get really excited about it because what's happened is that it has created so much new technology. Like if you think back even to what you have today, to 10 years ago, to 20 years ago, to even 30 years ago, it has changed dramatically. In fact, I'm even speaking to you from being videoed in Bali, Indonesia. I don't know where you're sitting at while you're watching this and you may be watching it on your computer, on your handheld device. I mean, to me, I feel like that's just simply amazing, but we need to get the balance back. There's two things that have been going on that have really indicated strongly that this balance needs to come back into place between the feminine and masculine energy and using our intuition when it comes to business. The first indicator for me actually really came into my peripheral probably about 10 years ago when, you know, this idea of our industrial revolution, creating factory workers, going into the schooling system, that ultimately is still happening today. And to me, that's what I feel like the nine to five corporate world is really about and why there are so many um, people feeling the symptoms of that, which is anxiety, stress, depression, not really knowing what their purpose is, sort of wandering around going, what's going on? What am I supposed to be doing in this world? And it's because they've fallen into a system and a way of operating that isn't necessarily in alignment with who they are and what they want to be, that these problems are growing and it is um, becoming quite an epidemic. If you'd like to learn more about myself and my work, please make sure you take some time to read my bio below and follow the links if you want to follow me on social media. Bye! <laughs>